So Mark, uh, you did concede early on, but the lads did do well there to get the equaliser and uh, pull out the 1-1 draw in the end. Yeah, I think um, very frustrated really because the, the, their goal came from our set piece, which was a bit disappointing. We uh, we just we um, we actually worked on it in training yesterday, the set piece, and uh, we just lost that concentration and, and didn't feel the edge of the box like we uh, uh, like, like we should have done. Um, and of course, they've they've broke away and, and scored. So uh, really frustrating because it was our own fault, it was our own error. Um, other than that, really, I felt that um, in our first half we, we pressed them really well. Um, from the front and uh, made it difficult for them to, to play out. And we nicked a, you know a lot of balls and you know we had a couple of great chances. You know uh, one that well a few that fresh, uh, thrashed across the face of the goal. Um, we had a couple of great set pieces uh, that uh, we, we, we should have scored from. Uh, so you know coming in at half time one 0 down we should, maybe should have been two or three up. Um, but then second half to be fair to the boys I thought they they responded well and. They dug in, and, and second half I thought we was excellent on, on a real, real tough pitch to play on, um, and dominated the game. And again, should have, should have won. As you said, the second half was much improved. Was there something you said at halftime that kind of changed things up a little bit and, and empowered the boys to do much better in that second period? Yeah, well, we just felt that um, in the first half, in the, mid, in the middle of midfield, we never, we never kept the ball. Um, every time we got it, we, we, we gave it away. Um, so we, we just corrected one or two things at half time in the dressing room. And second half, the two midfield players were miles better than, than, than the first half. And, uh, and we really got to grips with the game. And uh, we was in control, you know, and deserved the, the equaliser. Fantastic goal from Colton. Um, you know, he's, 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 um, he's been coming close over recent weeks. So uh, really pleased for him. Um, I hope that's one of, of many more to come. Um, but yeah, you know, we... Um, yeah, we were miles better second half, and uh, you know we should have won the game. Comfortably, two, we, we feel like we lost two points today. Fair enough. And uh, just a few player notes to touch on. Jamar Laza is back with the side. Is it safe to assume his his time at Coventry is done, and he's, he's back in Norwich City? Yeah, he's, he's back here now. So um, so he's he's obviously um, you know working with the twenty ones at the moment. And uh, I thought he was outstanding tonight. I thought he really put a shift in, and uh, he was he was probably our, our best player alongside Cole um, at Fadden. About I thought Cole was was, was again outstanding uh, defensively. Although the whole team defensively, I thought were <laughs> apart from the goal were, were very very good. So um, no no, it's I think. Um, you know, Jamal's uh, he showed today what, what qualities he does have, and uh, on, a, on like I said earlier, on a real tough pitch. And uh, our Twitter followers were asking about Shaquille McDonald, not necessarily a name that you would know as a Norwich City fan, but he was in your starting eleven today. So, you know, your thoughts on uh, Shaquille's involvement here? Yeah, well, Shaquille's been in here for for a couple of weeks. He he played at Fakenham. Um, and he, he always had another game today, and uh, he, he scored at Fakenham, and scored a good goal. And today was a tough game for him today. He couldn't quite get get in. He had a couple of chances. He perhaps should have scored with his head from a set piece in the, in the first half, which I know he'd be disappointed with. But uh, yeah, yeah, he, you know, he's been in, he's been in for a weeks, and uh, he, he's done well. And finally, you're you're kind of sitting in mid table right now. I suppose the goal is to kick on from this away result and just just try push up the league from here. Yeah, yeah, of course. I mean, I, you know, you, you want to, you, you know, we, we want to try and get a win mentality going on on, on the twenty ones. But uh, of course, um, there's a bigger picture to, uh, you know, for us. Certainly, certainly from from the staff in terms of the players and and, and, and watching them develop. You know, already we're seeing one or two that are, that, that are performing really, really well and and um, you know have up their game. And that's that's the aim is that we can try and improve them to 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 hopefully get them knocking on the door you know so so yes results are, are, are of course they're key everyone wants to win we want to win all the players want to win um, but um, it's, it's not the end it's not the be all and end all